The restaurant owner in Temple is still in shock after a car drove into the front of their restaurant Monday evening. Yeah, as you can see here, that footage is pretty dramatic. 25 News reporter Adam Schindler was there earlier today. This glass of water still sits where people were having dinner when a car came crashing into this restaurant. So it looks like somebody drove through the front of Joe's Pizza over here. Cell Matelier owns Joe's Pizza and Pasta in Temple. He was working Monday evening when he heard what he thought was a big crash on the street. I just go through outside from the back door and I see maybe accident in the road or something. So trying to help some, somebody. And uh, when I, I don't see anything, when I come, I see the car hole inside the, the dining area. The owner tells me that the driver stepped onto the gas instead of the brake while parking, pushing through steel railings, a planter box, and a table before. Coming through the glass storefront, where just minutes before, tables were full of people. At six, seven tables inside, or more, maybe 20, 25 people. Luckily, they were gone, but a woman sitting just feet from the window was struck by breaking glass. In her face, she was bleeding bad. She was saying, I cannot see, I cannot see. And then my wife had in her, in their, in her hand, and me with napkins cleaning and trying to we cleaned the blood off. That customer later left a note to the owner that partly reads, thank you so much for taking care of me. I'm fine, except for nine stitches. He says it's a miracle nobody was killed. Is lucky. And for the damage this, this can replace easy. It's not gonna be a big problem, you know, and glass is gonna come and stuff. But first, everybody is fine. That's, that's unlucky. The owner tells me that the woman that was injured is now his family, and he plans on reaching out to offer any help he can to make sure she's taken care of. In Temple, Adam Schindler, 25 News.